Well, the New England Patriots have certainly filled the hole of Tom Brady's departure. Welcome back, folks, and we have the latest in sports starting now. ESPN was the first to report NFL MVP Cam Newton will be taking his talents to New England. The Carolina Panthers moved on from Newton, its nine-year franchise quarterback, after agreeing to a contract with free agent Teddy Bridgewater. The 31-year-old Newton missed most of last season with injuries, but is reportedly fully recovered. In a brief message on Instagram Sunday, Newton said he was excited and included the hashtag Let's Go Pats. Reports say that Newton signed a modest one-year contract that is locked with incentive for good. Las Vegas sports bookmakers like the move, raising the odds of the Patriots winning the Super Bowl from 25 to 1 to 20 to 1. And while the national anthem is playing before the Utah versus Houston National Women's Soccer League game, all players took a knee wearing a Black Lives Matter shirt to protest racial injustice. 46 seconds of silence and remembrance. Done. Upsets Messi. And he cheekily chips Lionel it. Messi scores his 700th career goal in Tuesday's match versus Atletico Madrid. Messi's 630th goal for Barcelona's first team came in his 724th appearance for the club. All of Messi's Barcelona goals pair with his national record 70 for Argentina to put him in illustrious company, joining Cristiano Ronaldo, just to name a few, who stands at 728 goals. And the NBA is set to come back in a couple of weeks. That might not be the case for some teams. The Denver Nuggets have closed their facility due to coronavirus concerns after a round of positive tests came about. The Nuggets will reopen their facility based on the results of ongoing testing. Players are allowed to undergo controlled social distance workouts with coaches in the facility until the team leaves for Orlando on July 7th. 